to be in worship this morning. So I say what Solomon said, trust the Lord with all your heart. Lean not on your own understanding. Acknowledge him in all your ways and he will direct our path. I know the plans I have for you. Some of our struggles in life because we want to follow our plans and not God's plans. Why do you think you can get into a boxing ring with God? Sometimes we may think that our ways may be better than God's ways. What Brother Willie Carter doing on TikTok? Huh? Joe said, I've been faithful to you. I've been walking with you. I've done what you wanted me to do. And this what happens to me. You are very important to God. God wants you to prosper. God wants you to have good. God will leave you to your own ways. He'll try to tell you in the word. He'll try to share with you what to do. But if you are persistent in doing what you do because you are a free moral agent, he'll leave you. Grandma, hold on. In 20 years, they gonna have time out. I'm growing up as a little kid thinking, hmm. If you doing that to grown men, how am I going to survive? I should have did it how God said do it. Somebody say amen for comeback. I'm the one taking the licking. So the 29th chapter of the book of Jeremiah. Amen for having patience with me. Spend some time in communion and fellowship and meditation with him that you can hear his plans because we can't hear his plans when all we think about is our plans. Amen for the comeback. God's love for us is unconditional, but not his blessings. Understood a spanking I got one time. They said we got to communicate to the back end to get to the top end. Ah! I didn't have a cell phone. The best thing we did was put two cans together with a piece of wire so we got to talk to it. But when the money ran out, the love is unconditional, but the blessings are not. Amen for bringing me back to where I used to be for in my father's house. If your heart is good and you love the Lord, even though you made some mistakes, he will give you a comeback. But God has a blessing for you. But God said in the middle of your mess, whenever you in a mess, this is a word this morning, whenever you in a mess, he says, call on me. You may be in a bad situation, you may be in a bad place, but keep doing right. And when you do it, his hands will always be on you. When you do it, he'll always bless you. When you do it, he'll make a way out of no way. When you do it, well, they acted crazy with me. Well, why did you act crazy back with them? Stop listening to what people are saying about you. If God is in the business of bringing somebody back, why are you in the business of keeping them out? Amen. Hallelujah. Get them, preacher. Time up. Lord, you are. 